All right. So maybe it's because Hawks is the number two hero after Endeavor, or maybe the man himself thinks he is skilled enough to go undercover, being a mole for the Heroes Association, believing that Dabby is silly enough not to catch on soon, because this to me is so ridiculous. I think about putting myself in the shoes of Darby as a villain when having thoughts about a number two hero wanting to join the league of villains and I'm just like this isn't a real thing is it? <sighs> Hawks wants to meet Shigaraki in order to get a proper introduction into the league but Darby is smart enough to keep him at arm's length from that situation from becoming a reality. He may be drugged up from his burns and the pains of using his ability, but the man seems to not be that stupid. Although I won't deny that Hawk's persona and professional attitude towards his job makes it a real threat in that reality actually happening, no lie. The problem for me is that he is not that cunningly enough to make it as far as becoming a member of the league in my opinion. Or maybe he is. I don't know, but he will fail his mission from doing something dumb before gaining the type of information he'll need to destroy the league overall. Still, I could be wrong, yet I'm just saying he is definitely out of his mind if a villain as smart as I am would let the number 2 hero meet with the league's leader and not use him for my own selfish personal goals. Hawks is good. Don't get me wrong, and I'm sure as heck he knows what he is doing, taking off this assignment to help Darby to then gain access to the league, but it all just seems a tad bit far-fetched, and what's throwing me off the most is the single digit position of a hero going undercover. It's been your boy Roos or Mr 36, and whether you're watching or listening to this in the morning, afternoon or evening, I hope you guys have a good day. Oops, my voice cracked then. <laughs> Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to the YouTube channel and podcast especially. I'm out. Peace.